What do we have here? What do we have here? What, what, what do, do, do we have here? What do we have here? What, what, what do, do, do we have here? What do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 what do we have here? What, what, what do, 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 we have here? What, what, what do we have here? What, what, do we here? What, what, what do, 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 so this is a four voice loop sequencer. Um, you can record into each of the buffers. Yeah. Then you can yeah. play them back uh, yeah. with start and length controls to trim them uh, uh, accordingly. Um, you can also record to all the buffers at once if you'd like using this button. I'm not pressing on any of these because I don't feel like recording another example. Um, then you can play. <laughs> this will respond to a MIDI uh, play as well. The left button allows us to set a tap tempo, but again it will respond to MIDI clock as well we can turn we when we turn the gate off, what happens is that the loops will play through their entire cycle. When the gate uh, is on, like now, the loops will only play during the period of time that uh, that step is selected. What? Do we? You can also adjust the pitch uh, per step, right? So this will um, only change uh, on a, a gate, right? So it'll hold that pitch until it receives another gate and check the, the pitch at that point. So this track has uh, a step on the first and fifth step. So it goes from negative, uh, or, or from a fifth down to, to regular speed. Um, if I change this, do we have, have, do, 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 do. speed on that step have we can have, also do do do, do. What, what, what. put in a random chance do we? that these yeah. notes will reverse have, themselves have here what, what, what. do we what, 
What, what, what? How do we want? What, what, what? general idea, uh, and I'm sorry, we can also introduce res resets. Uh, you can't reset on the first step, so it can't just loop over the first step again and again. Uh, and there's no reason to put one on the last step, because that's when it will loop back anyhow. So these select steps two through seven. And so you can create uh, polyrhythms, uh, or, or, or poly, uh, yeah, polyrhythms as they... Uh, repeat against one another in odd increments, which can add a lot of diversity to a sequencer that's only uh, eight steps long, along with the ratcheting. So these aren't gate uh, steps. They're, they're ratchet steps. He would. Yeah. Uh, and so you can have all sorts of really interesting rhythmic varieties from only a few steps and only a few controls. Um, and, you know, I'm showing rhythmic stuff, but you can also play in longer loops and set the reset points at different times and, and create sort of evolving melodic stuff as well. Um, the loops are play once. So, you know, if, if this loop happens to be, you know, six steps long, or the equivalent of six steps long, and you set its reset point to seven steps, and this loop is however many uh, steps long, they'll start to phase across one another and create um, some really interesting evolving stuff as well. So you don't just have to use it for, like, you know, really rhythmic stuff. It can also be used for for ambient or soundscape design as well, where you take um, just a few loops and based on, you know, how you pitch them and, and the reversing and all of that sort of thing, um, it can uh, create some really nice evolving patterns as well or evolving sounds as well. Um, and so, you know, this is loop rhythm. Uh, and it, it's mono in from the left input and, and mono out from the left output. Uh, you know, this was a CPU thing. Um, you know, you could definitely set up a sequencer like this. Uh, I wanted to have all the controls sort of localized. I think, for me at least, that makes a patch much more usable and approachable, but if you didn't want to have all of this sort of control in one place, uh, I think you could probably uh, get this done in stereo too. Um, and it'll pass audio from the left input to the left output. Uh, but as you can see when it's playing, it gets right up there with the CPU. Do we have so I didn't want to push things, but I think it's a, you know, a fun patch that you can do a lot of different sorts of things with, whether it's rhythmic stuff. And I designed this for myself, at least, uh, with vocals in mind and creating rhythms out of vocals, 
but not necessarily in this sort of, uh, you know, like drum beat sort of way. Um, so like I said, with the option to set the, the repeat point um, or the loop point of the sequencers, you can get a lot of variety out of this and the option to turn gates on or off when the gate is uh on here it's a much more <laughs> rhythmic experience <laughs> right uh, but when you turn them off it doesn't necessarily have to be so that's loop rhythm um you know, like I said, I, th I think it's a, a fun patch to play around with um, that can do a lot of things once you dig past the surface and think about how you could set up uh, loops with different start points um, or different layering lengths and that sort of thing. Um, so I hope you check it out and uh, let me know if you do some weird beatboxing thing with it. Thank you.